Without Magic Mike. How are we doing, folks? Are we having fun? Perfect. I can tell by the look on all of your faces. Not really, because I can't see you guys. Fucking lights. Alright, well, I need a married couple. Do we have any married couples in the audience? You guys are like, yeah, but we're not coming up there. No, I need an amazing, uh, great volunteer. Married couple. Oh, give a big round of applause they jump up here on stage. Thank you too so much for bailing me out. I really appreciate it. But what are your names again? I'm so bad with names. Ashley and Magic Ian, nice to meet you. Ryan, nice to meet you. Perfect. Ryan, stand right about here. Ashley, right about here, right where we've set up the trap door to do the disappearing <laughs> thing. So we're going to try to do this. Uh, I recently did a show in Japan for Samurais and Ninjas. As you can imagine, I was kind of scared because they had the whole Samurai sword thing going on. But Ashley, they gave me a little souvenir to remember the show by. Yes. <laughs> a Samurai sword. But of course, yeah, they didn't trust me with the big samurai sword, so they gave me a smaller one instead. Because I'm a magician, that's why. So what we're going to do now, is we're going to attempt to cut the amazing Ashley in half. And then we're going to put her back together. Unless, of course, you don't want me to do the second part, I'll just cut her in half and leave her like that. Oh, okay, perfect. So, um... Yeah. Hold up, put your hand out, Ashley, hold your hands out. Oh god. Uh, okay. Why did we why did we <laughs> Okay, I knew I, I I knew I should have asked first. Uh, it's one of it's one of those shows, so I'm just gonna be Um I need a... Uh, yeah, I need amazing rings. Yeah. Oh we lied, we lied about it. But that's okay. It's it's that kind of show. Um, so we need uh, someone to volunteer their ring. Wedding rings, get up here. Anyone have a wedding ring? There. Oh, they didn't let you fall. Do you want another wedding ring? I don't have to be fitted, just another wedding ring. One more. Just one, just one's fine, just one's fine. Ashley, perfect. Thank you so much. We're gonna pretend like you just brought your ring, okay, Ashley? Go ahead and take it off. Just the ring, not you know, not the pussy. Watch. What we're gonna do is, uh, Ryan, right? Yeah. I use this to polish the samurai sword. Okay. The samurai sword has mystical power. So we're gonna make whoever's ring this is. We'll pretend like it's Ashley's ring. We're gonna give this ring mystical power. So I'm just gonna hide it over here. Ryan, hold on to the ring for me. Hold it up really high. Look at the audience and smile real big. Because that's highly desirable in show, show business. You know that. Are you guys ready? Yes. On the count of three, what I want you to do is, um, I want you to shake it. One, two, three, shake it. Get the whole body involved. Like, like the whole body. Like, I'm going to just take this magic wand right here. Actually take the magic wand, wave it over uh, your ring. We'll pretend it's like your ring. Do you know what that does, Ashley? Yeah. Absolutely nothing. It just yeah. makes you look funny. Aww. So keep going. On the count of three, it's going to happen. Ready? One, two, three days ago I did this trick. <laughs> what happened was the ring fell and it rolled and it rolled and it rolled all the way into a swimming pool. Which actually went all the way into the ocean and it disappeared for good. Whose ring is that again? Mine! <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay. You're a ventriloquist too, I didn't know that. <laughs> On the count of three, ready? One, two, Three, and on three you're gonna tap, but don't tap his hand too hard, because last show they left a bruise and we had to go to the emergency room. Unless you're in that kinky show, which I'm sure you guys are. Okay. Yes, we're gonna do it. Ready for the threesome? Here we go. Okay, ready? Tap on three. You're gonna tap. I'm gonna do this, and the ring's gonna float, float high up in the air. Ready? One, two, three, tap, and you can see it actually float. It was supposed to float in the air, um, but it disappeared instead. I should have told you guys before I started the show that samurais and ninjas, they're known for making things disappear real quick, so that's why I didn't float. 
Now, is that okay? She doesn't look too happy. Usually they laugh. Okay, here, here's a crazy thing. Uh, I don't know how this happens, but somehow, your ring, ma'am, actually, it's vanished. We don't know where it is, but samurais and ninjas can make things reappear real quick. Right, Ashley? Yes. You know it from experience, right? Scoot over just a little bit. Okay. Perfect. I'll move now. Thank you. You can see. Look, I don't know how that happens. You can see the ring actually jumps on the samurai sword. Woo! Now, is that your same ring? Okay, perfect. Now, what's your name, ma'am? Robbie. Robbie, stand right about here. I'm going to hand this ring back to you in traditional samurai ways. Traditional samurai ways. Uh, Robbie, right? I your name didn't change, so because people do that kind of stuff. It's popular these days. Right, right. Put your hand right about there. Focus on the ring. Robbie, I want you to will it towards your hand. Focus on the ring. Will it towards your hand as if it's going towards your hand. Will it. Will it. Focus. And how I did that was I just tilted the thing. <laughs> Give him a huge round of applause. Yeah. Folks, if you like the show, my name is Magic Ian. If you did not like the show, my name is Chris Angel. <laughs> so thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I'm going to give it back to Magic John. Here you go, Magic John. Magic John.